Hello, my dear friends. Welcome to my channel. While watching this video, if you have not subscribed to my channel, kindly subscribe to it and follow it to get the latest job opportunity. In my latest video, I have posted the job opportunity regarding coding teacher vacancy in Brightchamp. Some of you have asked me to upload the scratch programs of this Brightchamp. I'm going to explain you about a simple program. You can go to scratch.mit.com you okay and that you will have a screen that will appear like this you can go to start creating okay what do you mean by scratch scratch is nothing but all the things will be as it is it will be developed and preloaded in your website you need to align it that's it okay here we are having various instructions according to the program that we are going to do, we have to align it, okay? So now I'm just going to develop a clicker game for you. See, you can go to tutorial. You are having lots of projects here. Simple, simple programs are already developed here. This many programs are there. You can go to any program and watch it fully. I will tell you how to watch it fully. You can go back. Here you are having tutorial, right? Tutorial. I'm just going to develop a clicker game. So just click on that. You are having a video. Just watch it. Hope so, you have watched full, uh, full of the pro program and uh, you need to see the steps that they are doing. Then only you can able to do the project fully. See in your video, they have only uh, shown a uh, simple steps. That is, they have shown create a, a design as well as how to insert a balloon and all, okay? In order to finish the project fully, you need to watch it uh, step by step. Here is the step by step that has been given in this slide itself. You can uh, just uh, drag the slide. That is, you can move the slides and you can watch it, okay? See here, all the things are given, okay? I'm just going to do a simple uh, program for you. You can see it. I'm just closing it. See, you while explaining in your demo video, you need to explain the screen first. All the five parts you need to explain, okay? First leftmost corner is you are having various parts like motion, look, sound, events, control, sensing, operators, variables, my blocks. And this is a block instruction where we are just going to drag and drop this blocks here in the input screen, that is, this is called as a workspace where we are going to drag and drop the block instruction here. According to the instruction that has been given in this input area, output will be displayed in the screen case, okay? And these two symbols are for start and stop execution, right? Start and stop the execution. Here, sprite is nothing but the character. In order to define a character, here, other name for character is sprite, okay? And if you want to delete the existing symbol that is character in your output area, just click on to this. It will be automatically deleted, right? Then you can go to Sprite if you want to choose this character, okay? And I am going to create a clicker game for that I'm choosing balloon. And if you want to insert a background, you can click on to backdrop and you can choose any of the background. I'm choosing blue sky. Now we have designed a game, okay? After designing a game, you need to give steps. The first step is, since it is a clicker game, if you are clicking the balloon, your score should be displayed, right? For that, you go to events, and when this sprite, that is when the balloon is clicked, what should happen? it has to display a sound. So before inserting display sound instruction, you can click onto the balloon. 
nothing is happening okay after inserting start sound pop you will hear a sound here you can see i am clicking on the balloon a sound is played okay and if you want a score to be displayed while the balloon is clicked for that you need to go to variable and make a variable here i am creating a variable as score okay now you can see a score is zero that has been insert i'm clicking on the balloon now score is not increased right now to increase the score again you need to insert a instruction i am ins inserting an instruction called as change my variable my variable here is score by one what will happen when the balloon is clicked that is when the sprite is clicked a sound will be played as well as score will be changed to that is incremented by one okay now if you want to move this balloon randomly for that you go to events and you just drag and drop this instruction when play button that is start the execution is click what should happen it has to move the balloon for ever for that for ever you go to control block and you just drag and drop for ever instruction block okay for ever what it has to do while an execution is clicked for ever it has to move the balloon right for that you are go to motion and go to random position for ever go to random position now you can see i'm just executing it what is happening balloon is moving in a random position but it is in a faster way we cannot able to click it if it is moving fastly in order to make it to wait we are having the instruction called as wait instruction okay just drag and drop this wait instruction and the control block we are having it okay i'm just click, uh, giving a instruction wait for a second what is happening balloon is waiting for one second and it is moving in a random position you can see okay so well, this is the meaning of that instruction while clicking on the balloon you can see the score will be increased okay you can see the score has been increased this is what your clicker game is okay now we have developed a uh, balloon i am clicking on the balloon you can see the score is increased now if you want to restart the game again you can go to events and you are having this instruction when execution is clicked what should happen it has to set the variable to zero okay set the my variable to zero what is the my variable name here i have assigned the variable name as score okay now you can see i'm just pressing on the execution the score has been changed from 9 to 0 this is what the clicker game is now we have developed a clicker game in the in your demo video you can choose to any tutorial that has been given i am just explaining you a clicker game okay i am just clicking on the balloon sorry it's, it's since it is moving randomly you need to correctly click on that you and you need to correctly click on that so if you want to change this wait seconds you can also change but uh, this is a game called as clicker game i'm just mentioning it as 2 seconds okay i'm just mentioning it as 2 seconds now you can execute it it will wait and change the position and at the time you can click on to the balloon your score will be increased okay so now what you can do is while preparing for your demo video of uh, right champ you can go to tutorials you are having many tutorial whatever the topic that you are interested you can go and click on to the topic you can watch the video here you are having so many slides you should watch them fully here the step by step instructions will be given you need to follow all the instruction and you, in order to finish your project fully you need to 
see all the slides and prepare for it accordingly. This is what I want to tell in this video. If you're having any doubt regarding Brightjump, you can ask me. Thank you, friends. Thanks for watching.